In the East Bay tonight, a man in Oakland could face a lifetime behind bars. Prosecutors say he killed a woman driving past his house on Saturday. And more. Investigators say the man had just been frustrated over traffic noise. ABC 7 News reporter Tim Johns is following the story. In a pre-recorded video, Alameda County District Attorney Pamela Price announcing murder charges against an Oakland man. He's accused of killing a 21-year-old woman with an assault rifle as she was driving by his house. He was angry, prosecutors say, about noisy cars racing by his home, so he started shooting at random. There are too many guns in this community, and there are too many people who are too quick to use a gun. Similar incidents have made national headlines recently, people being shot for seemingly no reason. Mental health experts believe it's due to a combination of factors. They probably don't have support of family, friends, community to be able to express when they get angry, to be able to process when they get upset. And so instead what happens is it builds and builds and then people, for lack of a better word, they snap. Experts call it the frustration-aggression hypothesis, a theory that says aggression is the result of something blocking a person's ability to reach their goal. We really do have a mental health tsunami going on out there with anxiety, depression, suicidality, homicidality, uh, of substance abuse. I mean, the data is striking. Professor Thomas Plant teaches at Santa Clara University. Research, he says, shows these days people are much quicker to have an extreme reaction. When you have frustration, aggression, of frustration, stress, aggression, and you've got a firearm right there, you've got a, a, a big problem. A problem that may only be getting worse. The predictors of, of these incidents uh, don't seem to be diminishing. They seem to be increasing. In Oakland, Tim Johns, ABC 7 News.